An interesting thing happened last week. I made a video where I was driving my Aston Martin in the snow, and you hated it. Well, I'm here to make amends. Here's what happened. Usually on my videos, I get about 90 to 95% thumbs up and about 5 to 10% thumbs down, which is fine. On that video, I got 40% thumbs down. You were mad. Now, I personally was stunned by this because I thought you guys would love to see an Aston Martin sliding around in the snow. Hell, I would love to see an Aston Martin sliding around in the snow. But you... The primary complaint was that I didn't have snow tires, so of course I was going to slide around. In fact, I'm going to read you some of the complaints I got to that effect. Dipshits like you ruin it for everyone. Get winter tires, you fucking clown. Yep. Another stupid driver driving wit Aston Martin on snow wit summer tires. You stupid? Put snow tires and learn how to drive on snow. I hate it when stupid fucks drive car on snow without winter tires and then complain about the car's performance. What a complete cock. No winter tires. Dislike. Now here's what surprised me most about this. I took a Hummer to a racetrack and no one said, you should have a fast car to go on a racetrack. I took a Skyline to CarMax for an appraisal and no one said, you should take a normal car to CarMax for an appraisal. I strapped a TV to the roof of a Ferrari and no one said, you should have an SUV for that TV. But the moment I tried to drive an Aston Martin with summer tires on snow, <laughs> the hate. Now, most of it came from people who I like to call YouTube whiners. You could post a video entitled Cats Licking Each Other, and the video content would be cats licking each other, and the YouTube whiners would say, clickbait! So usually I don't take them all that seriously. But this time, YouTube whiners, you've won. That's because a few days after the column went up, I got an email from a company called Nokian who said they wanted to send me some winter tires for free. Now, initially, I was skeptical of Nokian because I had never heard of them. But then I looked them up, and it turns out they're from Finland. When you're from Finland, you know how to make a winter tire. Type Finland into Google Images, and one of the first pictures that comes up is a caribou pulling a sleigh. So I said yes, and I got the snow tires installed. And not just any snow tires, but studded snow tires. The only problem is that despite what a bunch of YouTube whiners apparently from Florida believe, and despite what it looks like right now, there's not actually enough snow in Philadelphia to justify snow tires. But then I discovered that Nokian's US headquarters is in Burlington, Vermont, a town that gets so much snow that the mayor and three city council members are adult polar bears. And so... Here is a detailed map of the United States. Now, I live here in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Nokian Tires is located here in Burlington, Vermont, 400 miles to the north. So I figured, time for a road trip. That's right. This Thursday, the 18th, I'll be leaving to take my Aston Martin on an 800-mile round-trip adventure to Nokian's US headquarters in Burlington, Vermont, in the middle of February. And you can follow along on my Facebook and Twitter pages if you want to see a lot of pictures of an Aston Martin driving through snow. Next week, I'll report back on exactly what went down. How an exotic car handles an 800-mile trip to Vermont in the middle of February, and how an Aston Martin does with snow tires. Assuming, of course, that I don't break down along the way. So usually I don't take them all that seriously. So usually, like, what is that, a train?